Hi, it's Alicia with Young 40 Mom Crafts coming to you live from Tennessee. Well, I'm not live. <laughs> ah, oh my. Ooh, look, he's got the red devil eyes. Oh, he's not a devil. He's a pup. He's very mischievous. Anyway, um, I don't have much for you again today. I've just been, uh, I haven't been feeling very well. But um, anyway, I do have some cross stitch and uh, a tiny bit of crochet. Um, my heart keeps going back to the crochet. I don't, I don't know why. So, uh, and I have some shout outs that I'd like to mention here, uh, momentarily. So, yesterday I showed you guys where I was working on the bottom of the beauty and the manicure. So that's what I did and showed you yesterday. And this is what I did today. I filled that in. Um, with the, the very pretty greenish color. It doesn't tell you the name of the color, but I'm going to finish her elbow tonight, probably. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm sorry about that. I'm probably going to finish her elbow. That won't take long. Um, and then add in a little more of the green to fill in the rest of part of her, her towel. Um, the back stitch is what's going to be so tedious when I finally get to work on that. And look at her, her nail. See how that bottom nail where her pinky is? So that's exactly what the pattern shows. It's very odd. I don't know what's going on with that. But anyway. Okay, so that's all I've got for cross stitch. I'll work on that later. And then a little bit of crochet I went back to. I am... Sorry, that... Look at that kitten. I played with him last night. He got me good. Um, okay, so... I crocheted some on this. This color is um, called Magnolia. I love it. It does look like the color of a magnolia flower, if you guys know what that looks like. It's like a, a very, it's a cream color, but it's got like a, I want to say a peachy tint to it, but it's not really a peachy tint. I don't know how to explain it, but it's it's a little more creamier than an ecru um, or an off-white, but I really like it. You, the camera doesn't even give it justice. It's just, it's a really, maybe a very, 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 very faint tan, maybe? inside but anyway the color of a cake uh, you know <laughs> just not a yellow cake not a uh, white cake but a, just a regular cake batter but anyway so this is going to be probably a blueberry cake so i've been working on putting that up i still have to finish that strawberry cake and one day i will and i will show you what it's going to look like in fact i may i may work on that here tonight too but anyway oh excuse me that's all i've got there and this is my project bag that i take to work with me so here's the the crochet and here i mean the cross stitch and then here's all the crochet balls i've got in here that i'll work on something at the office but anyway so the shout outs that i have for you the first one is going to be uh fiber fox fiber fiber fox studios you got to be careful when you say that fiber fox studios that would be courtney you guys go check her out she's a new channel um she does some beautiful intricate lace work i'm totally blown away by her um her technique and her style and uh just gorgeous and she makes it look so easy and and flow so easy um her her kimono is gorgeous and just just go check her out that would be courtney at fiber fox studios three separate words uh, my second shout out is going to be to Sunburst Crochet. She really doesn't need one. That would be Kim. She is just so precious. She probably doesn't even know I exist. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I, I just enjoy just watching her. She just, bless her heart, she has a lot of medical issues, but she just takes things with ease and stride. And um, yeah, so I really, I really enjoy watching hers. And usually her videos are very short. She does a lot of giveaways. Oh, yeah, by the way, Courtney over at uh, Fiber Fox Studio, she's got a giveaway going on right now, too. So another reason why you want to go check her out as well. But um, Kim at Sunburst Crochet, she does a lot of giveaways. And go check her out. And then the third shout-out I want to give is called Painted World Fiber Arts. Her name is Heather. Um, she's out in California. And I've been watching her since day one. She is just so precious. Um, uh, just very simple down to earth. And um, she she takes you on yarn hauls. And she has 
uh, crochet alongs for amigurumis. She does the animals like I do, um, but that's mostly what she does. Um, she, I don't think I've, she may do other stuff on her channel. I've watched all of her stuff, but I believe that's pretty much what she does. But the monsters that she's done recently, they are just the cutest thing. I told her I was going to have to make some of those monsters, and I participated in her amigurumi crochet along or knit along last time, and, um, I really enjoyed doing that. That was I. I don't participate in much stuff like that, but um, I enjoyed that. So, and I'm sure this is probably going to run out, as you know. They they usually do this this tape. So, uh, before I can finish talking, so again, here's my my list. We have Fiber Fox Studios, Courtney, and that would be Sunburst Crochet with Kim, and Painted World Fiber Arts with Heather. Um, so please go check out their channels. They are really really sweet ladies, and um, a joy to watch. So. That's all I've got for you. Sorry, it's not much, guys. But, again, I, I didn't even announce that this was Vlogtober 9. <laughs> anyway, we will see you guys tomorrow. I've got to frame my serenity prayer. So, I might have that ready for you to show tomorrow night. I'm supposed to go to uh, listen to a band at my local pub in Cleveland. And so, um, I may have to... Uh, I'll be filming late again tomorrow. So, but anyway, this, that's what I've got. We're going to frame that serenity prayer to give to one of my bosses for um, Boss's Day. And because she's going on vacation next week, so I'll give it to her Friday. And that's what we got going on. So, appreciate you guys watching, and I will see you tomorrow. Oh, peace out.